destruction of those things. Alright, welcome into Bay Oval for the Bay Plenty Cricket Premier T20 Final. Um, use here from the Bay Oval is that Green of one toss and never looks to bat first. It'll be Taylor Bettelheim and Tom McCurry's open the batting for Greedon and looks like Chris Atkinson open the bowling for the mount. Left arm of Chris Atkinson with ball in hand, top of his mark, bounding in. First one's full and negotiate into that gap at square leg for one McCurry off the mark. Atkinson in again, it's a lofted shot. In the air and caught. Matt Golding the catcher. That's a big wicket for Mount Monganui first start. Really big scalp. It's good in bowls. It's full. Bunted down the ground. Oh, they're going to get two off a of misfield here. Atkinson's in again. It's full. It's driven through cover point. Don't know if it's going to have quite the legs to get to the boundary out there. It's a great chase from Drysdale and Baldry. Oh, it's a great delivery. Perhaps another change of pace. The power play now. Yeah, Green at 13 for one. There's a play and miss. So length ball, edge down to third man. They might get a couple here. It's gone very fine. Tony Good on the man there doing the fielding. It's first over, just going for the single, so. Chipped in the air, straight to mid-off and it's out. Baldry has his man, another huge wicket for the mount, and looks like that one might have just spun a little, Dave. Bring on the offside. So this one's a full toss, and it's hit out to that man. Deep square. It's hit out to long on from Ranaraja for one. So Baldry's back in for his last over. Advancing is Ranaraja. Set into a pocket there. They're going to get two pretty easily, I'd imagine. Ben Musgrave at extra cover does the fielding. That's this last over. I think that's what you've got to do here if you're a Raja. You've got to have a... Oh, that's... Yeah, it's pretty adjacent, that one. Given out. It moved across the stumps and looked to be hitting hitting middle and leg from up here. It's Baldry's in again. Sweep shot first up and looks like it's heading towards the boundary. Bit more error on this one. It's hit him on the pad and it's been given. Bang, bang. That's Ranaraja as well. So the mount getting the two batsmen and who have been in for a good little period of time here, a little 10 minute period, and be two new batsmen at the crease, Dave. The boundaries and then struggled, struggled to do anything other than hit, hitting. Uh... It's an appeal there and it's been given. Dale Swan this time getting in on the action. Swan's in again. This one's swept up in the air. Big top edge. Musgrave under it and a bit more success for the mount. Jared Tuddy with a rash shot. Swan's in once again. This one's full and it's bowled him. It's Lorenzi this time. The Mounties cannot believe their luck. Tries Dale again. It's a big shot out to that mid wicket boundary about his opening bowling, so I'm not sure if his of his batting capabilities but perhaps he can show us something here today as the outside edges it off the back foot down to the northern boundary but Chris Atkinson tidies it up us the outfield which thrives in the, the summer months as there's a slog sweep play it out they'll get two off the misfield looks like Musgrave out there three for twelve so potentially that's the game right there isn't it's it it's a big top edge Gooden's under it and yeah, he's safe as houses. That's a really good wicket for the mount again. Gooden's in again, and it looks to have hit the end of the bat. They're trying to get through for a single. It's on at the bowler's end, and Pamari can't hit, but it was a very valiant effort to try and get that run out. This one's full on a stumps, and it's bowled him. More success there for Mount Monganui. That drives our bowls. He's not going to access the boundary down that way. Pamari takes the bails and it's been given out. Stumped is the call from the umpire and that's another great dismissal for the mount. Slow bowlers again doing the work. Mm. Mount Mungunui chasing 68 to win. Anyway, Correct. Musgrave on strike, Tuddy running in. 
First ball looks to be a wide. Tuddy's in again, it's back of a length and Musgrave just drops it onto the offside and it's really well taken single. So this one's full, it has Musgrave driving. I think we're about to be, see our first boundary of the match, ladies and gentlemen. And yeah, it's a great shot from Musgrave. Making these facilities available for the local players. Spencer Bowles, which is almost a, a long half volley to Drysdale. It rushes in. It's just a slap from Musgrave through extra cover. That's going to race for four, no doubt about it. It rushes in, and Musgrave plays a similar shot. This one a little bit more on the art, but fantastic boundary again. It's back to back for Musgrave, who races to 17 off nine deliveries. As rushes in, big, big edge, top edge from Musgrave to mid off, and it's a great catch taken. Dan Spencer, the man. That's a brilliant catch into the sun almost. It was, yep. It was a, it was a very good catch. I kind of I kind of thought from the moment he hit that that he may not catch that, and he pushed back, pushed back, and uh, scored, uh, took a great catch. Spencer's into Niven, it's straight. Big appeal, and it's been given. Bang, bang for Gredon. That's the sniff they needed. That's the sniff they wanted. Doubt in there. In the changing room, wouldn't it? Ooh, it's a, a half good. chance. Just that one driven to the off, into the covers, and great running. good rain. running in the end. Drysdale dives in as they try to take the stance, but just results in two. Mount Monganui 27 for two now. Drysdale taking middle stump to James Boyd. You can see the reverse lap straight away from Drysdale. It's a good shot. He got a full toss, so pretty easy pickings, really. He has developed an ability to to be a little bit inventive in uh, T20 cricket. So we see a uh, orthodox sweep this time. Didn't get right down, but still just gets a single down to that 45. Unless they get wickets, there's only one team. Oh, he's just oh that one's bowled him. He's gone back, and it's just rushed through. Eat my words. Dan Spencer's got the breakthrough for Gretton. Oh. Oh, he's been given. Crombie just not interested in that single at all, and he sent Drysdale back. Back of length, and Hancock pulls it away. It's racing to the road. That'll be four. Save your legs, Dave Hancock. Just got a touch of length there, Dave. Wasn't too short, but he got it up and over square leg, and it's raced away. Short, wide cover in place. As runner Arja drop short first ball. It's just one bounce four out to the midwicket boundary. Hands and catching fielders have been pretty well placed. As Hancock drives through the extra cover region. Might get a couple here. It's a quick outfit here at Bay Oval, so... Yeah, it'd be just the two. Nice shot there. Just pushed forward and drove through the line of the ball. Not a lot of turn, but enough pace in the wicket to be able to push for two. A uh, Boyd, I think it was. Two to win here. It's a big top edge. I think Green and they're going to claim themselves one more. No, it's dropped, and he'll be the winning runs for the mount. And there's a big round of applause around the ground as the winning runs are hit for the mount. Hancock and Crombie, the two young pups at the crease to get it done for the for the Mount Monganui cricket side. So that's the end of the uh, T20 final for Bay Plenty Cricket. Uh, congratulations to both teams who made their way to the final. Um, dominant performance from the mount.